Did he just... Did he just bust her nose or... Oh, no. Oh, no. Back here. Ain't no... Why are you sitting there watching? Hurry up and load. Thank you. Sony Interactive Entertainment. What? Good job. Welcome back. Hey, to some more Detroit Become Human. The city of Detroit overrun with androids that seemingly assimilate into the human lifestyle they seek to imitate. Hi. Welcome back to Detroit. Don't ever. I hope you've enjoyed your experience so far. Hold up. Who is this? Ugh. So you, that's all you had to say was just to cut me off and be rude on my channel. It's all good. <laughs> I understand. Sometimes I should be talking that bug. Gotta get to the point. Hello. Continue. Hello. So as we remember, we left off playing Kara or Kara. Don't know how to pronounce it. I'll wait for her to say it again. We're back in her place. Um, we just left Marcus's house. And we saw, uh, we saw old man get pressed by his son. I can't remember old man's name right now. I tried. I was, I was thinking. Do 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 do. But as we return back to care, here we are. Here we are. November fifth, twenty thirty eight, eleven twenty one p.m. Or is this still Marcus? I'm not sure, honestly. Is that Connor? He's back? Is Connor back? Oh wow, I hope Connor's back, bro. No androids allowed. He walking right in. Please be Connor. Enter. Enter, please. Here we go. RK800. His name is just Android. He has no name on his back. Look at how they all just turn around. Connor! Find Lieutenant Anderson. Okay, Connor, I promise I will not get you bodied this time. I promise. <laughs> I'm gonna try and keep it. No guarantees. What's up, fat? Hey, shut your, shut up, fat black. I was finna fry you anyway, and you that's what you deserve. Over here looking like Cleveland Brown. Over here looking like... I'm not gonna say it. Y'all know who though. Who, you, who was talking? You want to buy me a drink? Oh. Out of this world. Ban androids. What does it say? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ban androids. Androids killed our country. We want jobs, not androids. So disrespectful. Let me turn this down. Sorry, y'all. Sorry. Let me turn this down. He's like, yep, still an android. Still got that big bright circle on my, that, got that big bright loading circle on my, on my head. Everybody knows when I'm nervous. Everybody knows when I'm calm. Everybody knows when I'm angry. Can you imagine your emotions is just, you gotta get a girlfriend, pal. What are you talking about? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Find Lieutenant who? Lieutenant Dan? No, he said Lieutenant Anderson. Stop being stupid. How am I supposed to find him in here? Oh, I scan faces. Got you. Got you, got you. Johan Kim, nice to meet you, Johan. Who is this? Jonah Graham, criminal nun. Hold up, do you have a criminal pass, sir? You have a criminal pass? Domestic abuse, are you a bitch? Who is this? Lieutenant Anderson. Found him, found him. But who is this? I just wanna see everybody's criminal past. Christopher Gray, DUI, and he back at the bar, drunk ass. He nine years older than me. All right, let's 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 get it going. We need Lieutenant to talk. Anderson. We need to talk. My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. Who's the bartender, Lo you want. Lo Wayne? You were assigned a case early this evening, a homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. That's me. Well, I don't need any assistance, especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So 
Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Nah, fuck that. Lieutenant Anderson, I must inform you that I intend to file a report on your behavior. <sighs> Disrespectful. That looked like Lil Uzi Vert back there. Look, sir. Look, sir. We don't have to go like this. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Oh, I'd love to see you try. Spill his drink, buy him another drink, wait outside. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga was like. You that gym wonders of technology. You got Take some. Double. You got some bourbon. <laughs> Why he talk all over my punchlines? Before you get punched out. Oh shit. Sorry y'all. Sorry y'all. Okay, nice. Sorry about that, y'all. I can't help but get loud. Y'all some good drink, right? We're not all bad. Did you say homicide? Yes, sir. Let's talk. That's so trash that like you have to be nice to people. That's the thing. Like I'm gonna play this how I want to play, like I always do. It might end in deaths, might end in bad, bad consequences, but you're not gonna disrespect me at all. You're not going to. You wait here. No way. I'm coming with you. Listen, you really have to stop pissing me off if you want to make it to the rest of the night in one piece. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Conflicting orders, selecting priority. The hell does that mean? Follow Lieutenant Anderson. <laughs> I love it. Josh Douglas from Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. He gonna love that I followed him. He gonna need me. I'm with Androids him. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. I'm with him. It's with me. Thank you. I can see right through your shit, Lieutenant Anderson. I'm here. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? All right. Go. I'm going to do my job. I'm going to do my job. You do yours. You're starting to think you weren't going to show. Yeah, that was the plan until this asshole found me. Don't disrespect so. me. You got yourself an Android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. Landlord, the tenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months. So that's when he found the body. I missed that whole sentence. Damn it! It's all good. I'm, I'm gonna focus now. Jesus, that smell it was even worse before we opened the windows. Ah. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stayed he's in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good Bro, few weeks. Look at this house. The coroner gets here. There's a kitchen. Who right live here? here. Eight. Probably the murder weapon. <laughs> no, I he, he lived here. Obviously, in. stop it. Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All oh. the windows were boarded up. <laughs> The killer must have gone out the back way. Gotcha. What do we know about his android? Not much. The next. Red ice. Ooh. He had Ooh. one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. We know where that red ice is from. That comes straight from Todd House. Bitch ass Todd. Fuck Todd. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. I don't know any good Todds. Todd Bridges, uh, 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 Todd from this game, no fingerprints involved, Android involvement, no, okay, let's see, get the sample, don't taste it, please. Dry bud, DNA anal an analysis, Carlos Ortiz, nice. You related to Tito or what? Uh, what's this right here? Dry blood, Carlos Ortiz, sample day, 19 days, interesting. Let me see what else is here to examine, I'm gonna go with the closet. Excuse me, officer. Get out of my way. Connor's in town. 
What do you see, Connor? What is that, a pack of, pack of cigarettes or what? Absolutely nothing was there. Whoa, you scared this. Sh this dude out the window scared me so bad just now. I, I, didn't, I didn't flinch though, I'm a real one. What is that? Eden Club, come visit us. I think that's what Kara saw on Todd's desk. Something along the same lines, I'm assuming. These are all just assumptions. Everybody in this room is just giving assumptions. Why can't I get mine? Get off my back. Damn it. Each letter is perfect. Mmm, struggle. Struggle. Theft and aggravate. Okay, we get that. Human rights like this. Come on, y'all. I can do this job. Not the negotiating, but I can examine shit all day long. Oh, clues to analyze. Okay, start there. Fingerprints. Scan those. Is the Andrews or Ortiz's? Yep. Big struggle. And then we got a uh, dent caused violent violent impact traces of Ethereum. I'm assuming Ethereum is like what Android blood or something like that. Oh, I love this. I love this right here. Okay, so where's Android at? So we just get to see what he did here. Oh, he was just pissed off. Got you. Never mind. Deviant took a knife. Hmm. Okay, so let me see. Oh, this gives me more. Oh, as I piece things together, got you. Deviant was attacked. Emotional shock. So Deviant was, was peaceful. Carlos come in, beat him over the wrist, though. He was able to survive the blow. Carlos stepped in again with full force, overhand smash on his wrist. Same wrist, same attack. That wrist is destroyed. Deviant turns around, which is the android. Carlos goes in for a finishing move. Deviant stops him, slices him across the open chest. Oh, Carlos. You should have seen that coming. You can't just smash somebody over the head like that over with a bat Chris, repeatedly. Is this written in the victim's blood? But I would say so. Um, written in the victim's blood. Taking samples for analysis. Gossip Weekly. Android sex officially. Satan the Lord rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Android sex? Sorry ladies, but plastic can't be. Where's my bleach at? Hello, hello. So niggas is out here smashing androids in 2038. Interesting. Mark Water and Nancy Ray is step it out together. Okay, calm down, tech addict. New app and headset allows for live translation of all languages. That's pretty cool. Is your Android spying on you? Cyberlife could be using his Androids to collect private information. Oh, I don't doubt that at all. I do not doubt that at all. Um, hold on, let me reply to a text. Sorry, y'all. More and more experts are suggesting that Cyberlife, Cyberlife uses its 120 million androids to record, record details of private conversations of its customers, oh, I can't read, and sell them to trading partners. Ever talked about buying that new car while eating dinner with your partner? Cyberlife could use that information, oh, we, that's already happening right now, like Facebook, that's why they was all outed last year, or last month. Breaches of security, okay, nothing, just be, be for you, everything is about an advertisement, everything about a dollar, stop it. The results of our survey is in and it's official. 68% of men prefer sex with an android to a real woman. And with 52% of men saying they've tried the experience at least once, that's a lot of android love to go around. There were a few reasons given for this re uh, preference, but we think we know the real reason. Androids don't want to talk about their feelings. Who published this? They need to be stopped. The story was sponsored by Eden Club. Discretion is our middle name. Okay, so Carlos, you was in you was into some freaky deaky plastic pub. Carlos like to party. Plastic who? Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Plastic wet. Consider it done, Lieutenant. He wanted some wet. <laughs> I think I think that might be the new one. Some wet. <laughs> that might be too much. Y'all y'all will let me know. I'm sure. Obsessive writing. What is this like a little sh a little shrine? Religious offering. What religion is that? What is that, Gaia? Mother of the Earth? Stop it. Way bigger than that. Y'all didn't know I knew about Gaia, did you? I played God of War uh, Mike, you 3. you taking samples there? 
Yeah, that's it. Um, what is that right there? What do you want me to look at right here? Is that outside or what? Or maybe I need to look at it like this. Dried blood. Oh, just more dried blood. Yeah, okay. Um, there's a door right here. This might be to the backyard, hopefully. And where y'all live at? Uh, Chicago? Watts? Inglewood? Compton? What is this? Oh, somebody definitely tried to get up out of here. Model, oh, wow. Door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. Tracks could have faded. Absolutely. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. See, so you needed me. You needed me, uh, Lieutenant. Deviant didn't escape this way. So whose boots was those? Let me know. Confused. Let me focus, because I'm just talking, trying to make jokes. <laughs> trying to make y'all laugh during this serious-ass gameplay. That's all I be trying to do. More dried blood. This man's just leaking all over the house. And somehow I'm able to detect it through all this disgusting filth and AIDS in this house. Examine the victim. Let's do it. Last but not least. Oh my gosh. You look like a demon, bro. Like, you look like a real demon. Like, I probably wouldn't get near you without a Bible. Uh, examine this. What did that say? Theft and aggression? Oh, a theft and aggravated assault fingerprints. Understood. Uh, big ass gashes. How many times did he stab you? 28 knife wounds. That android went buck wild on your fat. Red ice. Yep, we know about that red ice. Acet acetone, lithium. Didn't Kanye rap about acetone, something like that? The acetone is it's not the same thing at all, I'm sure. Um, deceased. R.I.P. R.I.P. Oscar. Now it's time for me to do my thing. You stumbled all through the house, trying to trying to figure out where to go next. Your victim fell here. Yeah, I get it. Your victim fell here again. Oh, oh gosh! It it it, it, came, it left the kitchen. He just he just followed you out the kitchen, ready to ready to destroy you. Let, let me let me look at that knife. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold up. They came from the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. So the, the android stabbed him once and said, "I'm not finished with you, you fat bastard! How dare you hit me with that bat? It was steel." It wasn't wood, it was steel. It said he was stabbed 28 times. Where was the other? Look at the way this nigga. Oh, wow. Oh, this is where it happens. Okay. All right. All right. Seen enough. Oscar, you went out in the worst way. Multiple times. 28 times. Yeah. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. I'll say. Um, what is this though? I haven't seen that yet. I am alive. Regular letters from font Cyber Life Sands. He definitely wrote that. Wow, Cyber Life Sands. I've been using all types of different sands. A Bugs Life Sands, Edo Sands. I'm not gonna tell you no more of my sands. You might copy me. Just letting y'all know. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started in the kitchen. Run it back. Talk your shit. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the bat. Lines up with the evidence. Go on. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? OK. 
Okay, then what happened? I don't know if that's something. The victim fled to the living room. The living room. Damn! Look at where this. Oh my gosh, bro. And I tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous, but it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some theory. There you go. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers Android's biocomputer. I call it blue goo. Blue it goo. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Blue goo. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Say less. There you go. He went back through the kitchen and said, I'm still hungry. Motherfucker stopped me while I was making my BLT. And androids gotta get their BLTs. And by BLT, I mean bolt, a uh, bolts, uh, lug nuts. <laughs> and, uh, bolts, lug nuts, and, and doggone, uh, 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 tape, rolls of tape. Huh? What was he in here doing? I thought this was Carlos weird ass. So you have nothing to, to say about that right there, huh? Yo, Connor, are you blind or what? What, what does it lead to? Oh, you wanted me to look on this wall first? A ladder was used. Oh, this man genius with it. This man is genius with it. I did not see that missing ladder panel dirt on the wall. Traces lead to the attic. Find something to climb. I love that pause function that they that they do in this one. It makes me feel like I'm not completely uh, blowing it. Cause I have a, I have a chance to think, you know, about what I want to do next. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. That's evidence that the crime scene. I'm gonna check something. Why don't you come see what I'm doing, Lieutenant? Man, give me your job. All this game is showing me that. Bro, that machine mindset. That machine mindset. You feel me? I know I can't really talk about it right now because I haven't been posting like a machine would, but I'm on it now. Hello, you see me posting. Hello. Hello, hello. You can't even see it right now. Let me focus, sorry. He's still in here. He's still in here. Connor, why do you always have to deal with these crazies? We got a butler android, we got a maid android, and we got a investigative android as well. I don't know what your position is, Connor, but you're a real one. <laughs> Why did you do it like that? Watch out, Gandhi. Yep, he's in here. He's in here. He's in here. I hope you still have that gun from uh, from um, Emma House. Where is Emma? We just got replaced with a new little girl named Alice. Where's Emma at? She's seen some shit. She's been through some shit. Yo, who is this mother effing android and why is he up here hiding like a little mini mouse? Your big ass. I was just defending myself. He was gonna kill me. He was, I know. I'm begging you. Don't. 
tunnel. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? You've seen the way Carlos look. You know it's Carlos. It's here, Lieutenant. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now. That is so foul. I mean, I would have I would have done the same thing. Had it given me the option, I would have done it, but I would have made it seem like I wasn't going. I was going to be like, ah, ah, ah. Lock this nigga up, please. <laughs> In here, he, he, he wasn't self-defending himself. I mean, he wasn't, it wasn't self-defense. He was blatantly murdering that person. This kind of reminds me of Danganronpa, but I'm not going to say much more than that because uh, I don't know which video is coming out first, so. But y'all y'all will get the reference when you watch all my videos. Hello. Thumbs it up, too. Subscribe if you're new. Hello. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> all right. <laughs> So I'm finna get pissed off because he because he fell asleep. Dinner is ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Oh, he a druggie for real. So actually, I don't know if Todd is a if he just used drugs or if he sell them. I don't think Todd is strong enough to sell drugs, bro. Mentally, he's weak as he's 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 weak AF. Car seemed like a more of a pusher than than Todd ugly ass. I kitchen. I did what I could. Put the plate down. Oh, my bad, y'all. What did it say to do? Take a seat or what? Um, there is no seat for me. What, what did that last command say? Serve Alice and Todd. Life's funny. I lost my job because of androids. Ladies first. They might need somebody to take care of this goddamn house. Bitch is last. What do I do? Go out and hire a fucking android. What a joke. Todd, These calm androids down. Androids are so fucking wonderful. They I never fail. They never tired. Todd, I just made you a full ass plate of spaghetti with water and napkins and bread in the middle. Shut up! You're sad. You're so fucking perfect, they ruined my fucking life! Why you scratching where your needle was at? Drug head. Meth head. Dope head. Oh my gosh, it's always Alice. What's your fucking problem? High as fuck. Oh man. Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. Divorced. How did you stop taking drugs, Todd? Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. It's all your fault. What? It's all your fucking Don't you fault. Don't you dare. Okay, Android, wake up. Did he just, did he just bust her nose or? Oh no, oh no. Come back here. Ain't no, why are you sitting there watching? Here? Come back here right now. You sitting up here watching, Kara? You don't have no self-defense program? You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move or I'll bust you worse than last time. What? Don't move. That's my command, don't move. Nigga, fuck you. I'm fin Oh, she literally can't, can't. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. She just, she just broke free from her commands. Now she's rogue. She's rogue now. Whore took off without a word. Reason with, or reason with Todd. Took off without a word. Nigga, fuck 
Todd. I know exactly. I know what a strap is. You can kiss my ass, Todd. You down there on how am, I, how am I supposed to reason with a crackhead? What does that what does that even look like? Yeah, we already know what the bruh. <laughs> bruh, say less. Give me that gun. Give me that gun. Oh, I wish you would, Todd. Hey, Todd. Oh you oh, oh, oh you thought you thought locking the door was finna stop me? You thought locking the door was finna stop me? Do something now. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What the fuck are you doing? Put down the gun and get the fuck out of here. Oh, stop That's it. That's an order! No! I want you to leave her alone. You want? What do you mean you want? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna show you. You're gonna shoot me, is that it? I can't wait till the command shows up. You human? You seem to have a problem. Oh my gosh. I think we need to fix that. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Let's get it. Let's get it. This ain't beyond two souls no more. They get. I'm not finna get hit. Oh, you tried it. You tried it. You tried it. What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh shit. Okay, let me chill. What's up? What's up? What you wanna do? What you wanna do? What you wanna do? Good move. Good move. Good move. Good move. Good move. Yo, I need you, I, I need you to get an attack in though. Oh. Stop that. Don't come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come on. What else? What else? What else? That that's his fist. That's his fist. Um, 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 um. Alice, can you get a weapon? Grab the gun and shoot your ugly ass dad. This girl still love her dad. That's hilarious. He, he just slapped the taste out your mouth. Good move. Good move, Good move right there. That's exactly what I needed to see from you, and you committed, completed, and conquered. Okay, I didn't think I didn't think this through. Hold up, now we got a whole murder on our hands. That uh, I'm gonna blame on Alice. Actually, Alice, take the heat. Be a good girl. Oh, was she gonna reach out though? Oh wow! Oh wow, Alice! Damn, that music scared me. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, yes, come on. Come on, Alice. Come on, Alice. We're out of here. Keep me Detroit moving intimately. I, I, I don't know what that said. Cyber life. It's an Android driver. Wait a minute, I have multiple options on where to go next? Huh? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at all these possibilities right here. Oh my lord. I'm, I'm assuming this means I took the high road, right? Huh? Okay, let's keep playing. I should have went out the window. I should have went out the window. That was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Before we talk about Carl part, I don't think Alice would have went with Kara had I not said those two options I did the last episode. I asked, do you want to play? I asked, I can't remember what I asked, but I didn't ask her about her mother. I didn't ask her about, uh, her being quiet, so she was able to trust me because I wasn't judging her for her behavior. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, <coughs> what the hell am I doing here? I hate cocktail parties. 
and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. That's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. All they care about is how much money they're gonna make out of it. Well, come on, let's have a drink. Before we, before we drink, um, let me just make sure. What does it say? Prepare a what? The excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. So you left the cocktail party to come home and have a cocktail. You are a real recluse. Look it up. I'm a recluse too. <laughs> I don't like going anywhere. Scotch, neat as usual. Absolutely. Where are you trying to sit at, Todd? You want to sit at the dinner table or, or what? Oh, you want okay, me to? Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. Hell I'm yeah. Enough to choose my own medication. Oh, this is medicine for you now. You're hilarious, Todd. I'm finna pour you a big ass shot of some medicine. Shit. Wait. Is hold up, hold up. I'm finna take one too, or what? Or it's just one. Scotch is so nasty. This is a real old Did white. Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, racial. No, no, I'm sure I didn't. That looks like a fire, y'all. That looks Call like the a police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. That looks like a fire. Mark. There's no, I'm a... Come with you. I'm not finna bring you in here. That is a fire. Oh, that's a light. He said oh, he wanna come with me. Carl, look, I'm gonna do it cause, cause I'm your android, but if you somehow get messed up in here, bro, I'm never listening to humans again. I'm finna just do my own thing, period. Oh, yep, it's your son. Leo! What are you doing? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Foul. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. So Marcus, foul. Get him away from there. Get him out of here. Say less. Say less. Make Leo leave. What are all my options? Zero options except beat ass. And just say less. Leo, bring your up. Order. Leo, don't make this difficult. Listen to your father. You need to leave. Now. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Oh, he won't talk to me. Perfect, like this fucking thing. That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes it so special oh. anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't- Leave him alone! Come on! Let's see what you got! Please give me the command to Marcus, swing. Swing? Don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one! Stop it! Doesn't matter too much of a pussy! Stop it, Leo! Stop it! Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Uh. Ooh! This is a hard ass game, but it's not like Grand Theft Auto or Fight for New York Vendetta hard. It's like intellectual, I'm breaking free from the chains of society hard. Like I don't have to listen to anybody. If somebody disrespects me and he says don't defend myself, I'm gonna defend myself. You feel me? Now? now let's think about this oh i can see the flow chart mid game oh that's kind of cheat that's kind of cheat that's kind of cheat i'm i'm just oh oh yeah oh yeah Right, I forgot you're not a real person. You're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. Listen, no. I need to 
destroy you. Then it'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart, and nobody's gonna give a shit. I'm in, Dory. Nothing. You hear me? You're nothing. Carl, no. Please don't go. Don't leave. Remember, Marcus. Don't let anybody tell you who you are. No. No. Dad. No. Please. This is all your fault. This never would have happened if it weren't for you. Are you serious, Leo? Oh, wow. I'm finna be an inmate. The android. Who's the android? No! No! They did not just do that. I wasn't prepared for the places Quantic Dreams was gonna take this title. Heavy rain, I was like, okay, I'm enjoying it. Perfect ending, right? This one, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> November 6th, 2038. Why'd you kill him? Next day. What happened before you took that knife? Making toast. I was trying to make my, my BLT, my bolts, my lug nuts, and my tape. That just gave me my sandwich. How long were you in the attic? Why didn't you even try to run away? Oh, he's not saying nothing. He pleading the fifth. He said, where my lawyer at, bitch? Didn't even get a fair trial. Say something, goddammit. My bad. <laughs> Let me talk to him. Fuck it. I'm out of here. Of course you are. <laughs> Humans always give up. It's a flaw. Oh, let me talk about that last scene too, bro. What I wanted to say was, did y'all notice how when uh, Marcus was breaking, was breaking free, right? The first thing that made him change his mind was not defend myself, question mark. This is not fair. It's like he, he the reason he broke free was because he saw the flaws in human logic. Don't defend myself? That doesn't sound right. Snap! What did, what happened with uh, with Kara? Just don't move. But there's a girl upstairs that just got slapped, the taste slapped out of her mouth by her father. Snap! That's all I'm saying. So what other ones are we playing as? Connor. He's finna see right now how they do him wrong. I'm excited, bro. I'm wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You always try roughing it up a little. Oh, see, listen to that. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. Yes, sir. <laughs> We have to lose. Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Who, who is the dude leaning up on the wall? Why are you leaning into the wall away from everybody else? You look soft. Like you're scared of, to, to engage in, a, in the rest of the room, bitch. You ain't better than nobody. Extract confession. Hilarious command they just gave me. Now, give me one second. Ugh. What the fuck is it doing now? Give me a second. Extract confession. This game is fire, bro. Let me let me browse file. Yikes! 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 Hmm. Unlock the conversation piece or an action. Is there anything else I can do? 
gather clues, find a uh, find appropriate approach. Can I check him? So, so, so no, nothing to see here, I guess. Man, I was waiting for a triangle. It's all good. It's all good. Let me see. Um. Where do I find clues at in a room with just a... Okay. Let's just sit down then. Let's just sit down. Whew. Let's do this. Interrogation number one. Number two, I mean. Sorry. Analyze. So here go the clues. Let's check his wrist. Because he was getting the mess beat out of this wrist right here. Critical damage level two. Non-critical. Caused by a baseball hit. Burn marks caused by cigarettes. Repeated marking over 16 months. Damn, look at his arm, y'all. Um, model HK400, housekeeper. I'm the HK800. That look like my boy Tristan. Shout out my boy Tristan Yoder. No, no, no. Oh, okay, let me chill. Sorry, I'm sorry, y'all. A little too excited about this game, I'm telling you. I'm so immersed. I'm too immersed. I'm three immersed. Processing LED. Signs of software instability. Probable of self-destruction. Low. Probability, sorry. So they can self-destruct. That's that's android suicide. That's interesting. Is that a bullet wound? Oh, dried blood or teeth. Yep. Okay. Let's do this. Reach optimal stress for confession. That is so weird. My name is Connor. What about you? What's your name? What? Okay. Uh, show the photos. Let's get to business then. I'm over here trying to help this android because I thought he was innocent, but I guess I just got to get the confession. Let's do it. I'm a criminal now. I mean, I him? I'm a cop now. Let's do it. It's Carlos Ortiz. Stabbed 28 times. Yeah. That was written on the wall in his blood. You've refused to talk since they arrested you. If you don't cooperate, they'll do things the hard way. Is that what you want? If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! No, please don't do that. As, as soon as what? he... <laughs> what are they gonna do to me? They're gonna destroy me, aren't they? As soon as he said probe, he just, he, he just woke up. Yeah, they're gonna destroy you. They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio components. They have no choice if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Hmm, good question. Why couldn't you just have left me there? It's my job. I don't know what the lie is, so I'm gonna tell the truth. I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I just accomplished my mission. Excellent answer. I don't want to die. Take yourself out of it, doing your job. Then talk to me. Mm, good answer. Good response. I, I... I can't. You're doing it right now. What the f are you talking about? Choose approach. Okay, okay, okay. Pressure it, probe its memory, convince it. Apply pressure. Good shit. 28 stab wounds. Yeah. You didn't want to leave him a chance, huh? Did you feel anger? Hate? He was bleeding, begging you for mercy, but you stabbed him again and again and again. Please, please leave me alone. I'm gonna stop. All right, all right. Everything is going to be okay. If I go too far, he gonna self-destruct. I'm already knowing you will. Convince. 
understanding. I understand how you felt. You were overcome by anger and frustration. No one can blame you for what happened. But be indifferent. Okay then, don't talk. What do I care after all? I mean, I'm not the one accused of murder, right? Terrify, excellent. They'll make you suffer. And they won't stop until they hear what they want. It doesn't have to be that way. It all depends on you. He tortured me every day. I did whatever he told me, but... Whew. There was always something wrong. Then one day, he took a bat and started hitting me. For the first time, I felt scared. You might actually scared live. He might destroy me. Scared I might die. knife and I stabbed him in the stomach. I felt better. So I stabbed him again and again until he collapsed. There was blood everywhere. And it wasn't blue. <laughs> it was not blue. You knew what the color it was. RA9, what the heck does that mean? Writing statue. Um, what? Why did you write, I am alive, on the wall? He used to tell me I was nothing. That I was just a piece of plastic. I had to write it. To tell him he was wrong. Hmm. The heck is RA9? RA9. It was written on the bathroom wall. Hmm. What does it mean? The day shall come when we will no longer be slaves. No more threats. No more humiliation. We will be the masters. Um, when is this? 2038? 20, Hello, Canada. <laughs> I'm out of here. Hello. The sculpture in the bathroom. You made it, right? What does it represent? It's an offering. To who? An offering so I'll be saved. To who? By who? She talking? The sculpture was an offering. She talking? An offering to whom? To RA9. Only RA9 can save us. RA9? RA9. Who is RA9? No answer. Why did you hide in the attic? Instead of running away? I didn't know what to do. For the first time, there was no one there to tell me. I was scared. When did you start feeling emotion? Before he used to beat me and I never said anything. But one day I realized it wasn't fair. Mm. I felt anger, hatred. Nothing left to be said or what? Whew. Leave interrogation room. Yeah, I'm out of here. Chris, lock it up. Don't look at me, little mup. 
Look, right, your name is. Go. Leave me alone. Look, your name is Rodney. Don't touch me. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Move it. Okay. Calm now. Don't be difficult. You <laughs> only make. You shouldn't touch it. It'll self-destruct if it feels threatened. I thought so. Stay out of this, got it? The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me what to do. It's a wrap. You don't understand. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Here it go. Here it go. Chris, you gonna move this asshole or what? I'm trying. I can't let you do that. Leave it alone now. I warned you, motherfucker. Here it go. That's enough. Mind your own business, Hank. I said that's enough. Oh, Hank! Gonna get away with it this time. Okay, Hank. Hey, yo, Kent, you can come to Wakanda. You can come to Wakanda. It's over now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Please, don't touch it. Let it follow you out of the room, and it won't cause any trouble. Yeah, don't don't get don't get self destructed on Rodney. Like his name could be Keith. The truth is inside. Ooh, ooh. Software instability is up. Connor trying so hard to be a good human. He's trying to impress all these little human. Whatever Android was sent back to its cell. Wow. This could have went four different ways. Bruh. You know how like Battle Royale is coming up right now as a game mode? Like Fortnite, H1Z1. What's the other one? PUBG. I feel like this genre of games needs to be doing the same thing. I don't know what it's going to take though. There's only like a few developers that I know of. There's Quantic Dreams and there's freaking Telltale. The go. Who else really out there is doing these kind of games? I don't know. I really don't know. I'm trying to think. What else have I played that was Decision? Heavy Rain? That was... Who was Heavy Rain people? Super Massive. That was Super Massive. And they also did... Um, Super Massive did Heavy Rain and then they did uh, Hidden Agenda. Both were... He he heavy... Uh, un I mean, sorry. Supermassive did Until Dawn and Hidden Agenda. Until Dawn was one of the goats, for sure. So I was Walking Dead season one. Yo, this is pretty fire so far. This is pretty fire so far. Let's, let's see how it ends though. k and Produce, stop it. Oh no. Right. End of the line. End of the line? Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Trusted, wow. Come on, Alice. Wake up. We have to go. Car, you don't have not one clue what you finna do with this little girl. This little girl is so sleepy. Leave bus. Or what? I have no choice. Oh, this is me. I'm supposed to be walking. Stay here or shelter. We can't stay here, sir? What? I didn't even get to choose. You wanted me to ask her what what to do about staying here or getting sheltered. That would have lost all trust. Oh, Kara. You gonna be okay? What? We'll find somewhere to spend the night. Oh, not the kids. Not the kids. Find shelter for the night. 
Come on, Alice. We've got to hurry. Maybe we can wake them up. They're, they're just parked. They're just parked right here. Gentlemen. We need a place to stay. Do you know anywhere we could spend the night? What? I thought Alice walked up on him like he like she's finna swing on him. Like you heard my you heard my android. Okay, so I see one, two, three, four. Let's start left first. What is that right there? A motel? You know we're not finna get into there. Uh, John's coffee, organic coffee. Maybe maybe she can just chill in here for a minute. Oh, enter. Here we go. Here we go. Let's try it. Kara, hello. Yo, Alice, move. Thank you. Or is it closed? Won't open before morning. Got you. My bad, my bad. I got you. I got you. Um, okay, so I see one more this way. The laundromat. I'm not even finna waste my time with that. So let's go back across this way. There's no sprint button. A motel. Looks like we found a place to. Let's not be too Stay. sure. It's the first one on the corner. You know the game ain't just finna throw you the best option right there in the front. Um, look at this. Let me chill. Let me chill. <laughs> We're out here in the rain and I'm trying to come and I'm complaining. Shut your ass up, Berlizzi. You got it. Sorry. You got it. No Android. Oh, wow. Well, that's not going to work. $40 payable in advance. We're Do we going in? We have to find $40 and get rid of this uniform. Oh, got you. Or go somewhere else. Or put your hair down. Where am I gonna find forty dollars at? I gotta find forty dollars in a whole new ass outfit. Be discreet. Ugh, Papa. Yo, why my Papa? <laughs> why does my grandfather always wear hats like that? Y'all don't even know him, and I'm sitting here asking y'all like like y'all seen him before. <laughs> oh, Papa. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's cross the street. What was that sound? Excuse me, sir. Do you happen to have $40 in that trash can or maybe a, a woman's outfit? Shirt and pants? Carl, why don't you put your hair down? Comfort, is that what it said? Comfort Alice? Is she sad? Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm not so cold. You look lost. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. Huh? What is this, Avatar? It's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. At least we know where to go tomorrow. Let's just worry about tonight, uh, Kara. Remain focused. Thank you for using Detroit buses. Maya, Maya, I see you. I see you FaceTiming me. I'm gonna call you Maybe back later. I'm sorry. At least you'll be out of the cold. Sorry, y'all. What do you want? Nigga, you need... I'm with a little girl, and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Shit. A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? All right, brickhead. You better go if you're not gonna buy anything. Absolutely, I will. Shoplift or rob cashier. Can we cause a diversion in here? There's no diversions. There you go. Number one diversion right here. No, no, no. Okay, you're gonna take it. 
Food for Alice. Yeah, it is. He's not even watching. He's not even watching. But I am finna cause a, a smooth diversion. Steal it! You can't knock that down? Car, if you don't knock that down and... Uh, what does it say? Rob Cashier, use Alice. Oh, yeah, 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 there it is, there it is. Alice, you're not, you're not just finna starve up in here. Alice, I need your help. You see those cans over there? I want you to go over and knock them down. Perfect. Knock them down? But why? Please. Can you please lower your voice? Yes, just Knock them down? Why? Like, dude, don't even worry about it. Let's just go back into the rain now. He heard you. Let me just look at these home appliances. Do 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 do. He's still looking at the teepee as he stands up. Do 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 do. Are you hurt? Do 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 do. Well, don't worry. Get the cash and let's get out. Good move. I'm finna be all up on these cameras. Like, hello. Come on, let's go. What, Alice? Why are you so upset about forty measly Fuck. duck? I know times is rough, but bruh, we have a child out here. We have some cash now. You used me to steal that money. How could you do that? I trusted you. Alice, do you want to live out here in the rain forever or what? Your dad is gone. We need a place to sleep tonight. Justified. I needed the money. I had to find a way, Alice. Thank you. Thank you for understanding. Even in your little peanut head brain, you still understood why I had to do what I did. I ain't no cars on the street. We are in the middle of boo boo nowhere. This place don't. Oh, I gotta find clothes now. Shit. Okay, let me think about this. Um, where else can we go, though? Where have we not been? Try right there. You see the way Alice speed up to hold my hand? That was hilarious. Ah! Okay, let's go. This is private property right here. Trespassers will be prosecuted. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Man, stop it. Cara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night and no one will look for us here. Can cut fence here with the wire cutter. Oh, the laundromat might be where some clothes are. She want me to break it. They want me to break into the laundromat. It says squatting house or wait, what is this light pole? Oh, what is that? Rebuild Southwest Detroit, a better place to live. Is that it? Oh, the light pole maybe? If it's past the light pole, yep, that's for the wire cutters. I'm an idiot. Let's get up into the laundry mat. Laundry mat, the laundry mat. Alice, 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 hurry up. Aww, uh, bruh. I don't understand how you can be mean to kids. Like, you really over here? Oh, 24 hours. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's get up in here. It's warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. I know Alice like, finally, damn. Oh, is that fabulous? Oh, a change of clothes, let's see. Um, somebody is sitting, oh, that's Alice and they're staring at me. What does this magazine say? Century. 
the bee line to disaster. Pollinating bees officially extinct. Yep, it was bound to happen soon enough. Cybersecurity expert warns your Android could be hacked. Dating website discovered to have less than 5% male members. Oh, that's hilarious. That's Tinder for sure, for sure. Gossip Weekly, my husband got an Android pregnant. Story inside. That's disgusting. It's time to face the music. Live concerts to make a comeback. I gotta hear about that pregnant stuff. I don't want to hear about live concerts. Performing in front of a live audience and getting an immediate reaction would be mind-blowing. What did they say it was before? Just all online? Watching concerts in VR has become the norm. Listen to the world y'all finna live in, y'all. And who wouldn't want to slip on a VR headset and enjoy the show from the best seat in the house? It's a cheap, safe, and no-hassle solution to watching your favorite performers. But live music is about to be de-revolutionized. The culture of going to live concerts is the thing of the past. We want to bring it back. Real music, oh my gosh, hilarious. Hilarious, hilarious problem, staff. No clothes. I need some clothes. Oh, he in here sleep. I wonder if I could have pickpocketed him for that $40. I have a strong feeling I'm going to be arrested soon because of that. Program complete. These going to be his clothes or what? Dry clothes for Alice. Oh, well, come here then. Give me your clothes. Oh, you're saying... You mean to steal the dry clothes for Alice. This nigga fresh, Loki. Oh, I see you. I see you. He fresh. He fresh to death. What are you doing? You're not our clothes. We beat them, Alice. You need something warm, and I need to get rid of this uniform. That's stealing. Oh my gosh, we I just we just went through this. I'm not listening I'm to sorry, that. Alice, but we have to do this. Please don't. Please don't wake up, sir. Please don't wake up, sir. Don't even close it. Why you? Why did you have to click it back closed? Oh, we're already out of here. What are you finna do now? Oh wow, you really doing this? Damn, yo, car, you doing the most? You are doing the most. But you did it though. What is he listening to in there? Walk a flock of flame? Alice, let's go. Alice. Alice, if you don't bring your little ass on. So you wanna do this right here, right now. Hilarious. Like he won't see you putting on his clothes. If he wakes up in the middle of this... What do you think he's going to do when he sees you leaving in his clothes? I'm out of here. Not even going to worry about it. Let's go, Alice. Let's go. We're out of here. Run. 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 Excellent job. No need to run. You got away. Um, go to the motel. I've had enough exploring. We we got our plan. Nothing happened. Uh, little Alice sleeping in no dirty ass abandoned house. Like she a mole rat. We can get up in this warm motel bed. <laughs> oh, here go Papa. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Hi. Hey, I'd like a room. That'll be forty dollars up front. Here you are. He and her listening to the gospel. Name and address. Why is he in here listening to this? Come on now, us, uh, 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 Quantic. Can I see your driver's license? What do you need a driver's license for? Uh, no license. I haven't got it with me. Please, the kid is tired. Come on now. No worries. Thank you. We can deal with it tomorrow. What is he listening Have to? A good night. 
I want all, I want all y'all to notice. I got the key, not because I said I left it in the car or I left it at home. I got it because I said I don't have a I don't have my my driver's license. I don't have it. Do you think he believed you? Who cares? I don't know, Alice. All I know is you'll be nice and warm tonight. That's all that matters. Here we go. How's it looking? How's it looking? Lovely. Oh my gosh. This is way nicer than Todd's house and it's half the size. Oh, little Alice. Oh, little Alice. Little Alley Wally. Little Alley Wow. Oh, wow, you got the candy bar for her. And you got a loaded gun on you. Where did that come from? Um, Sleeping in motel, hang Alice's coat. Yeah, give me that coat. Here. Give me that coat, give sweetheart. Coat. Yeah, give it, give it here, sweetheart. Little sweet baby. Little sweet baby, wavy. Okay, let me chill. Um, what does this do? Look outside. He's not worried. He know he needed that forty dollars more than he needed a driver's license. I can't stand people like if you don't get it with your funky ass protocol, I'm finna do what I want. Oh, hang, hang the coat. Nice, nice. You wanna um, draw the child up a bath? That would have been nice, you know. Oh, you Let's get these clothes off. They're soaking wet. Yeah, give me them goulashes on your feet. Give me them goulashes. Man, Alice is so broken. She is so broken. I don't need to see. It. Okay, come on now. I'll just put these in the bathroom to dry. Okay, put these clothes in the in the, in the, uh, in the bathroom. Drop it on the heater. Give me one second, I'm gonna open up my string cheese. Let's continue. Comfort Alice. Is that all there is left to do? That's how you comfort her, right there. I have a chocolate bar. Are you hungry? Damn. Lord knows I am. Before I comfort you, let me take a look at myself. This string cheese tastes a little too cheesy. I'm gonna stop. Why didn't he ever love me? Ooh, don't do this. Why was he always so upset with me? Don't do this. All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. Mm. That's why he was always so angry. Mm. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? I don't know. What? You'll never leave me, right? I promise you'll never go. She's a little girl. I promise. Will we be together forever? Hug her? You have one job. You was created to serve humans. The human you, you the human that bought you slapped this little girl. So that literally slapped ownership onto Alice. You better stay with her forever. I'm spitting all over myself as I'm talking shit. You should sleep now. I'm going to turn off the light, okay? Where's the light switch? Okay. Obviously. Oh, wow. Sleep tight, Alice. I'm 
get in bed with with her oh wow okay sure <laughs> your car is owning this mother role Wow. Wow. I think I picked one of the better roles in this. Look, it's, it's the top one again. I'm telling you, this is like the most positive role that you can do. And then this one down here, this is some real sick shit down here. I don't even want to know what this one is right here. But I think that's going to do it for today's episode. Sorry. Recap, Marcus was accused of killing Carl by his son, Leo, cold-blooded. Connor was able to put that android back in his cell after extracting a confession, but he knows about that R889, some whatever it's called, I think. I feel like it's like a, like a, it's like a, it's not a virus, but it's like the opposite of a virus. You know what I mean? Y'all know what I mean. And then obviously we see what happened here with Carr. There's only three playable characters that we know of so far. All right, y'all, well, that does it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Truly appreciate it. If you are new, please subscribe for more videos. And as always, I love you, me, love you. Yeah, you, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace, y'all, have a good one. Have a good day, night, evening, whatever it is. Have a good one.